Mastering US Imports, Electronic Music Gear. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be diving into the fascinating world of importing musical instruments and accessories for electronic music production into the USA. If you're a musician or music enthusiast looking to bring in these items from overseas, you've come to the right place. Let's get started. Before we delve into the specifics of importing musical instruments and accessories, let's first understand the role of customs brokerage in this process. Customs brokerage is a specialized field that deals with the complex procedures and regulations involved in importing goods across international borders. Customs brokers are licensed professionals who assist importers in navigating through customs clearance, ensuring compliance with trade laws, and paying the necessary duties and taxes. When importing musical instruments and accessories, it is important to have a customs bond in place. A customs bond acts as insurance to the government that all applicable duties, taxes, and fees will be paid. It provides a guarantee that the importer will comply with all customs regulations and fulfill their obligations. Having a customs bond is mandatory for all commercial importers, and it helps expedite the clearance process. Another crucial aspect of importing musical instruments and accessories is the importer security filing, also known as ISF. ISF is a requirement by the U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, for ocean cargo shipments. It involves the submission of specific information about your incoming shipment, including details about the importer, exporter, and the goods being transported. Failure to submit an accurate and timely ISF can result in penalties and delays in clearance. International trade agreements play a significant role in importing musical instruments and accessories. These agreements help facilitate trade between countries by reducing or eliminating tariffs and other barriers. For example, the Generalized System of Preferences GSP, allows certain eligible countries to export goods to the USA at reduced or zero tariff rates. Understanding and leveraging these trade agreements can greatly benefit importers of musical instruments and accessories. Apart from customs brokerage, customs bond, ISF, and trade agreements, there are a few additional considerations to keep in mind when importing musical instruments and accessories. It is crucial to research and comply with any specific regulations related to the type of instrument you are importing, such as wood species restrictions for guitars. Additionally, selecting a reliable shipping method, conducting proper packaging, obtaining necessary permits, and being aware of any applicable certifications will help ensure a smooth importing process. And there you have it. A deep dive into importing musical instruments and accessories for electronic music production into the USA. We hope you found this information valuable and informative. If you have any other topics related to customs brokerage or international trade that you'd like us to cover, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay updated on our upcoming videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Disclaimer notification below.